Okay, everybody, this is Luciano speaking. I am here in front of my little test bench machine, test setup. I used to measure coils and to optimize stuff. The system is not really optimized. It's a simple here, a uh, simple magnet here, uh, which is the run magnet uh, with a hall sensor and a coil. Here I've got a rotor with five magnets, all south, all north. This one, this rotor, see it better here, is south, north, south, with two coils. I can't really remember the specifications, I had them lying around from another generator. Uh, the core is much too small for the, the magnets, as you can see. But still, uh, with no load, no cap, anything connected, the machine will run at about 2000 RPM and it will produce about 26 volts at that speed. Now, uh, the thing is, I'm uh, trying to use a cap bank two cap banks actually uh, here with these two connected in parallel these are single caps uh, they are loaded after the output of the coils goes into the bridge rectifier then into this relay that is switched by a 555 circuit when the circuit is off it goes into this cap and uh, this cap is dumping. Then if it switches, it will go into this cap here, and then this one will dump into those. Now, here I'm measuring the output of the dump, here the input into the cap, the first cap. This is the load. It's a 12-volt light bulb, car light bulb, 20 watt which is much too heavy for this machine, but I want to try and see how far it goes. When I switch the 55 circuit on, you can also see a LED flashing and you can hear the relay uh, that is switching. When the LED is glowing, the relay is on, it's off otherwise. So we'll switch it off for a moment and do a test run. By the way, this is a very sophisticated circuit I have. <laughs> I'm just joking. It's the simplest you can have. So this is the machine. I will power it on. It should go with one cap hooked on, which is the first cap. We can monitor it here. Uh, it should run around 1800 RPM. So here it started. You can see the voltage going up. We're at 5965. It's going up nicely. Here's the machine running. You can hear it picking up speed. We can measure the speed. It should be around 1000 RPM but it's climbing rather quickly. Twelve hundred, well, we'll give it time to go up. You see, we're at 20 volts now, 21, 22. You can see it's still climbing. We can hear speeding up a little bit. Coming close to 1600 RPM. Seventeen hundred soon. Yeah, well that'll be good enough. We're at 28 volts. Now we'll hook up the load to the capacitor. And you'll see the bulb going up, but the whole thing, which is very normal, lens effect, the whole machine slowing down. 
and the bulb gone, we're back to one volt. And well, so we'll get, let it get up to speed again. Take the load off. Everything could be optimized uh, with the hall sensor position. I just hot glued it on, so it's not really effective. The coil could be more effective closer or further away. It's just, but this is just for testing. So now we're coming back to speed with 13 volts. And we're going to activate the 555 circuit. This slows the system down a little bit, which I don't really understand because it should dump into the other caps. You can see on the right hand you've got the two caps going up, on the left hand you have the first cap. Now we're about 13.8 volt. Time to hook up the light bulb. It stays on a bit longer, but as you can see, it's going down and the lens effect is still there. Actually, the machine has slowed down nearly to a stop. You can hear it. which I don't understand because the coils should never ever see the light bulb. Yeah, well, that's all there is to see. Okay, the system is going up again. The coils should never ever see the light bulb. So why is the system slowing down? I can understand it slows down when it sees the cap and the caps are switching but somehow okay maybe I made a mistake maybe I hooked up you can see there's a mess I've got to check all the wiring maybe I'm missing a blocking diode somewhere or maybe there's something else I don't know I don't know. But I shouldn't have the system nearly stop when the light bulb is hooked on. Okay, maybe it wouldn't glow, but I don't know. Maybe some of you know. Maybe someone can explain. Be very grateful. Bye. See you next time.